Welcome back to We Happy Few. Last episode, we explored a bit around the army base, found out we couldn't get inside of it, and explored it around here. And at the very, very end of the last episode, we just discovered this quest, Bring Out Your Dead. We need to search Mrs. Marley's body. So apparently Arthur used to know Mrs. Marley. And we just spotted their body. So let's check it out. I can't believe I'm doing Oh, great. Now I've got a rock. <laughs> search the body. Done. What's the next step? I'll probably have to read the note for that. Grapefruit juice. Fresh carrots. Is this open safe related to their death? Dearest Archie, I doubt you'll ever read this, darling. But if you do, please forgive me. I know you wanted me to wait for the fourth flavor, but I couldn't. The vomiting was bad enough, but the memories came back. They began screaming every day, all day, and the steam whistle and those horrible huge steel wheels every day. I still hear them out here, but it's quiet. If you talk to them a bit, they quiet down, even though you know you're lying to them, and they know it. It's a ghost town here. The streets are crowded with ghosts. Most of them are friends. But there's very little to eat. I'd hoped to make my money last a bit longer, but I put it in a safe for keeping, and I've lost my key. You'd mock me for a silly woman, but I haven't eaten in days. I think if I can get the safe up to the roof, I can drop it onto the pavement, and if it all goes well, it will break open. I wish you were here to help. You're so good mechanically. Okay, so they lost the key and dropped it from far up, and that's how it's been opened, but how did they die? Did they lose their balance and accidentally went down with it? Okay, what is this, though? I know you wanted me to wait for the fourth flavor, but I couldn't. What? Fourth flavor of what? Like the grapefruit ju juice or Just something? Feel so stupid, fooling. But she did get the safe open. That. Hi. That might be the whole quest. I guess there's nothing we can do for him now. Who? What are you what are you looking at? Well at least we have our memories. Right. What if this is it? Yeah, that's the whole quest. Hey, you know what to get, are we? So I wanted to head over in this direction to check out these dig spots. Remember this area is where we found the, we found all these dig spots in like a, a place that said it had mines in it, even though it didn't seem to actually have mines. But My let's head over God, there and get the little. I never could beat him. He never ran Whoa. this fast. What's his secret? Quest found crazy legs. Hmm. I wonder if their speed is related to... Uh, where did I see it? There was like a drug? I don't know if it was a drug I could make. There, there was something, some sort of a drug that I saw somewhere um, that gave you faster speed. I don't know where I saw it. Yoink. Whoops. Yoink. Do I need to catch up with them? Supposed to stop them. Oh, are they? They're still moving, right? No, they seem to be staying there for now. Let's go catch them. Gonna need to get my sprinting up to catch them, I think. Ah! <laughs> Home. Home. Let's try to catch him over here. Like, go directly against where they're running? I'm assuming they're just doing loops here. Oh, hold on. Let's 
How the hell do I stop him? I didn't even see a like a, an interact thing pop up. Do I need to be here at this quest marker? Oh come on, you pack rat! You can't take all this with you. Ooh. I just got the idea that what if I dropped cow drops? That would slow him down. <laughs> but I mean, I don't think they'd want to talk to me, right? That's a very violent action. Hmm. Let's dump the Lee Enfield rifle. It's really heavy. And I don't need two shovels. Nor do I need a head knocker, really. Or a branch. I do have caltrops. I'm gonna try to just, like, talk to them or something. Are you coming? Or do I have to go towards you? Oh! Uh... Shit! I always forget the button to put him away. I'm like, do I need to press the button for the hotkey, or do I need to press F again to put it away, and I forget. So, hence why they're coming at me! <laughs> Stopped him for a second. I think I might have to use Galtrops. Alright, you know what? This is a good way for me to test out my perfect blocking, which gives me a 25% chance for them to fall over. So let's try it. I can't, I can't tell if that's perfectly blocked. I don't know what that looks like. Oof. You should never have to eat your dog. <laughs> You're dying from your wounds, indeed. It's not a lovely day. It's not a lovely day at all. Am I getting perfect blocks or not? I feel like I would have activated by now. Does it do what I think it does? A well-timed block with a weapon can knock your enemy down. Yeah, they, they fall down to the ground, so it'd be obvious. 25% chance to knock down when doing a perfect block with a weapon. And the video just shows them blocking right before the hit comes. Not really that close to when the hit comes, too. Like, seems to be pretty generously before. What if I just hold it down? Oh, there we go. You meat. You're meat. Oh, they're so weak. You're there we go. What have we come to? Uh, I'm not going to loot them. Yeah, I'm not going to loot them. Man, I go through these healing things fast. I definitely want that skill. Uh... Where was it? Oh, this one. That gives you 50% more effective healing items. That would be amazing. Anyway, I think I need to caltrop this person. Oh, hey. New note. Bridge. October 8th, Executive Committee, City Hall, the Parade, Wellington Wells. Dear committee members, it's a lovely day for it. We are ransacking the last of the old Victory Gardens. There might be enough potatoes in the entire garden district to last two weeks. Do you plan to starve us all to death? If you have no food to spare, could you at least open the bridge so that we can try our luck in the wilderness? I'd rather die by a bandit's hand than starve. It's so much more glamorous. Your former neighbors, Colin Drisdale, Elliot Fitzloyd, and Chris Fox. Okay. We got a runner to stop. Do I really need to whack him? That seems unnecessarily violent, but I can't think of anything else to do. To the Hydra bases. Huh. I mean, I guess I'll just put it down, huh? 
I didn't put them there. They're not in my hands. Hey, buddy. What? That is amazing. So, uh... How am I supposed to stop that runner then, huh? Will they... Night's coming on. Trip on all my stuff? Will they trip on this trash can? Obviously they don't. Do I need to just whack him? Don't hurt me! Jesus! Okay, don't hurt me. that worked. Christ. Arthur? Is that you? You've changed, haven't you? You want my recipe, don't you? Here, take it. Good lord, Arthur. I never thought you'd turn into one of those. He's right. What have I become? Oh, I feel so bad. Was there another way to do that? Because I can't think of what else to do. Freaking cow drops didn't work. I can't seem to talk with them. Being in front of them doesn't seem to stop them. Sorry, old friend. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna go with it. So I got a recipe for something. What the heck was it for? I also got skill points. Three available. Mm, do more damage hitting people. Uh, this requires five. I think I'm just gonna save up for the 50% better healing. Yeah. Ah, oh, Flash. Oh, I've seen it before in vending machines. That's where I've seen it. Oh, it takes ten of the night blooming none such as in a flower bag? I don't even have that. And sugar. Run faster if a bit louder. Street drug. Not available from doctors. Increases sprinting speed significantly for a short time. Now, let's start heading this way, down to the dig sites. Or perhaps I should sleep. It's been a while. Ooh. Oh. Lily bulb. Can I plant the bulbs? Can I make my own garden? I don't know, though, like, you haven't slept, like, a debuff isn't popping up, so I guess I don't need to sleep, really. The well-rested thing, if I do sleep, would be a bonus, but... Jesus. Oh my god. I don't think I'm fine without it. The weight's not too much of a concern right now. Yeah, this road's leading down there. Another note. Tub. September 29th, 1964. Dearest Kate, I think I found a boat. Not a real boat, of course. Barely more than a wash tub with a washcloth for a sail. But the smaller the vessel, the more likely we are to sneak past the patrol boats, don't you think? I know nothing about the Kearns, but it must be pretty hard to sail west and not land on Ireland. I haven't seen you in seven days. I hope you're alright. I'll look for you in the shadow of the crashed V1 at noon on Saturday. I hope to God you get this. If not, I'll try to come back for you, if I make it. I love you. I hate these times. Love, Tony. So that explains why people don't take a boat. I guess real boats don't exist, so you'd have to make something makeshift if you wanted to. And... Which you could do, of course, but even with that, there's apparently boat patrols. That will stop you. Aren't these bad guys? Oh yeah, it's trespassing if I step on there. So they don't care about me if I'm out here. What is this? Oh, this is a shelter? So I can sleep here. Track access hatch, too. The chemistry said, okay, I need to take them out. Well, well, well. Please don't make a fuss. That was easy. Please don't struggle. Here, have a seat. Perfect. Oh, 
Oh, that's just a body. I don't want that stuff. Like, shovel. It's a heavy. Rusty shovel. It's heavy and doesn't weigh. It doesn't have much of a use. Don't actually need to remove these, but I guess it gives me two ways in. If I didn't have a lockpick, I could have done that. So, another fast travel point. Oh yeah, let's dump all our stuff. Move all crafting items from 86 pounds to 72. That actually wasn't that much. And let's dump off all my rotten stuff. Mushrooms, rotten apple. I'll keep the lily bulbs. Rotten potato, F that. Moldy bread, F that. Probably have some weapons. Um, see, I can use these to distract targets. I don't know if they have any benefit over throwing bottles, though. Probably a bigger range, I would imagine. I'll keep that. But I'm pretty happy with the help as a non-lethal weapon, and then uh, I guess the shovel if I want a lethal weapon. So I'll just keep those two. What else could I get rid of to save weight? What's taking up so much weight? Let me check. Oh, the scotch, actually. That's half a pound each. I don't need that much scotch on me. Oh, here's some stuff I can get rid of. I have 11 disposable safe crackers. I don't need, think I need that much, and each one is 0.6 pounds. We'll get down to like 5. Should be fine. I also have 42 glass bottles, which is absurd. Yeah, it's pretty good. 53 out of 106 pounds. That's good. So this enables the whole thing, right? So now I can fast travel. Ready for my next visit back here. Yeah, cool. Wait, V to upgrade work bin, workbench. Oh, I thought I pressed that and something popped up. Yeah, I don't think I found any upgrade kit. Anything I want to make? I need the chemistry set for this, but I don't want to make it really, and I don't have anywhere near the stuff for that. Let's make healing bombs. Obviously, I don't need the table for that, but yeah, I want to make more. Can't make them during combat. Oh, I can make repair kits now. I got that as a recipe, but I don't think there's any need for that. Fixes leaks, holes, and mechanical problems in many circumstances. How do I use one of those? Can I use one on my current weapon, the help? Because that actually needs to be repaired a bit. I can make a pointy stick. Yeah, do I have a repair kit in my inventory? I must, right? One. Yeah, I can't like double click it to use it. How would I use it? How would I repair this? Is that not what a repair kit's for? Fixes leaks, holes, and mechanical problems in many circumstances. Yeah, that description suggests that's not for weapons. Doesn't mention anything about weapons. Hmm. I've never seen anything that actually needed a repair kit, though. Which is pretty surprising. It's been a while. Alright. Let's sleep. Oh yeah, our sleep is at 8%, so it's about to get bad. Let's sleep until it's daylight, so we can actually see stuff. Oh. Oh. You'll move, Sandman. Huh. Oh, I don't have any fresh water. I need more canteens. Those are surprisingly rare. Still there, huh? Cool. <laughs> Rigor mortis has set in as they're sleeping. That happens every time you sleep, right? 
that's normal. They're just unconscious. They're definitely not dead, surely. Let's keep going this way. Is there ever anything in these trunks? Or is it just a hiding place? Ooh, I need these for healing items. track. Oh, a couple dick spots. Very close. Maybe this one's around these rocks, I would bet. Eh, close to him. Oh, somebody's spotting me. Eh, whatever. Come find me if you want. Duct tape, rusty shovel, cow drops. Oh, they have a shovel. <sighs> Ooh. Come on. Come at me. See ya. Why are we doing this to each other? Like, was that your spot? Did you put it there? Did you bury it? Why do you care so much? Weirdo. Flimsy cricket bat, dart, sewing kit, safe crack, or charcoal. More have I done, Rich? I didn't think you'd hear me. You're always such a sound sleeper. I just meant to sneak out with the map and then I pretend someone else must have dug it up. But you had to wake up, didn't you? And go off like you always do. I didn't mean to hit you that hard, Rich. I was just scared. You're scary, you know that. Everyone's scared of you. Remember when I told you I was the only one not scared of you? Oh, staring at people up close will upset them. Keep it up and you'll have a fight on your hands. Oh. They're not coming back. Well, They're not going to get to hear back. the end of that. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, let's try that. I don't need to do anything fancy with these simple what am I enemies. Doing? It makes sense that staring at them up close like that would freak them out. That makes complete sense. Fair enough. Teaspoon of sugar. What's that? Wait, it's not a quest I have? It's an exclamation mark, I guess. Mysterious. Uh, maybe that just means an interesting thing to look at. I want to get these other dig spots, though. Drops, cricket bat, disposable safe cracker. I'm gonna have a lot of flimsy cricket bats I'm throwing away. 
was that smoke about? What rough beast slouches towards the house of bread? Yeah, I found the quest. Seems like a very jolly house. Warning. House is protected by explosives. Oh, Never mind. Fun. Doesn't seem very jolly. Is it really protected by explosives? Oh, don't be silly, Gretel. If someone put a gingerbread house in the middle of the forest, surely they meant for us to eat it. Oh, yes. Steal the sugar. Oh. I'm going to keep an eye out for tripwires. Now I'm going to walk slowly. There's one. And I don't think I... I need like a, a tool to dismantle them, so I'm going to have to throw something at them instead. Which is going to be quite loud. That's not where I said it would go. Also not where I said it would go. Yeah. up here? Oh, because of the sugar. Oh. Auction, Friday 2 p.m. One pound of sugar. Please bring your tradables to the auction. We will not exchange goods for promises. Oh. Um. Should I, like, throw a bomb? A banger? Should I try throwing a banger? Oh wow, that looks nasty. This might just piss him off. Whoa. Well, I got rid of a trap, but yeah, that did nothing to them. Uh, I need something else. There's got to be some other type of thing that would deal with this. But maybe I can just push through and just run in and see what I can get. Yoink. 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 Stop that damn music. Okay, I'm good. Wait, they're gonna chase me. Okay. Yep. Yep. No. Inventory. No, I don't have a weapon anymore. They saw the bottle in my hand and they were like, they're gonna kill me! Oh. Okay. Wait. St steal the sugar? Did I miss some sugar? Just sure. Where? Oh, there's one on the ground. Oh, uh, let me see if I can get in range of it without being too close. There we go. Yes. Hell yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, that pissed off a lot of people. Owners are here, I guess.
Caltrop? Or do you think they'll just forget about me? Yeah, they've forgotten about me. Okay. Yeah, we're fine. Whew. All right. Yeah, finding sugar is like a whole quest. Then sugar is quite rare. Chuck Peter? Used to be you couldn't pry him out of the pub with a crowbar. I shall execute the judgment of the Lord! I think I've already been judged. Oh, Jesus. Uh. Okay, then. That's a quest, right? I don't know how many quests I've already done, apparently. Stop the stoning. What the hell? You're right. How are you holding up? Sometimes I hear horsemen okay. at night. It's the poor, isn't it? Are they just going to know where I am always? I got a feeling they might. They're throwing stones, aren't they? Yeah, all right, buddy. You want to know what it feels like? Yeah, that's what it feels like. Do you like it? Jesus. I almost used up all my damn healing items. I think I need to just knock them out. Nexamide pill. Never seen that before. Ah! There. That stopped the stoning. Everybody else is coming for me, though. They noticed that I went in here. I don't think they did. Yeah, we're fine. chest or open the chest anyway this is everything in it it's a lot of stuff oh enhanced rock I sharpened this rock with love so it can hit further and harder <laughs> that's hilarious oh a normal potato that's rare yeah take it all Right? Uh oh. I'm trespassing, so they're like, oh no! Don't worry. We'll find you and we'll fix you up. Please don't fix me. Now, where's the body? There. That's the where the devil drives. There. Okay, so they also didn't like that, which is fair enough. Kind of weird, you know. A little suspicious if you loot a body. That's the one. Get him. Oh. Oh. Save a bit for the next minute. We'll laugh about this later. I see you, you murderer. No, you don't. You can't see me. I'm concealed.
It's over there. Man, people really come at you in groups. Alright, yeah, we're good. Whew. Forgot all about me. What was that sound? Don't worry about it. Oh. Passed a dick spot while I was running. Duct tape, branch, caltrops, dart. Uh, yeah, I'm getting pretty close to the weight limit. I got a bunch of weapons to dump. Rusty shovel, rusty shovel, flimsy cricket bat, flimsy cricket bat branch. That goes 30 pounds. Quest starter over there. Well, let's go check out that quest. Hive mind. Oh, right. Well, bees. The only reason I know for being a bee is making honey. And the only reason to make honey is so I can eat it. And so the bear set out to climb the tree. It said optional make a padded suit. I think I should wait till I have a padded suit to go into a swarm of bees, considering I'm out of healing items. I don't know why when I go to my quest tab, it seems to always set me down like here. And for some reason, scrolling up and down with the scroll wheel is exceptionally slow. This is me scrolling as fast as I can. Eh. Eh. It's faster just to grab this way. I always got to go from here, grab this, go up, then click the thing. Get some honey, equip a padded suit, optional. Probably a bad idea to rob bees unless I'm wearing a padded suit, isn't it? Would a padded suit really be that effective? I guess. I, I mean, you think a beekeeper suit would be better. I'm not doing that quest right now, unless you have a suit on you. Nope. Ah, I can make a sort of padded suit. It wouldn't pass among decent folk, but it would oh. protect me from all sorts of things, and people trying to hurt me, probably even bees. So you get the recipe from looking at the sign. That's kind of cool. Okay, what does it take to make? I need a workbench, and I need four more coarse linen. I only have one. Oof. That's gonna have to wait a while. Well, that's all the dig spots. Let's keep exploring out this way. I can't keep doing this. <sighs> hmm? Overs? Total? Some sort of a sport? A counter? Score counter for some sort of a sport? I don't know what sport. Oh, another one of these. Still don't have an extractor. They're not even marked on the map. I'm not going to be able to remember where they were. I can only make one mark at a time, so I can't just, like, mark them for their long term. Hump. Is this another one? All these lumps seem to be something special. No, oh, not this one. Okay. Yeah, nothing much seems to be over there. I can see pretty far, and if I can't see anything, I don't think there's any point in going that way. I'm getting old.
Am I my brother's keeper? Am I? Toys and tiny beds. Tiny beds in every house. At least I don't have to wait. Note. Recordings. October 4th, 1964, Executive Committee, City Hall, a parade. Dear sir or madam, we understand that you have exiled us to the Garden District to protect yourselves from our dreadful memories. It seems a bit unfair to us, since none of us is willingly a downer. We don't choose not to take joy. It's not a style of life that anyone would choose. What makes us wastrels is that when we take joy, it gives us the most violent reaction. The body thrashes, the memories come back, edged in fire. But surely this is not news to you. We write for another reason. We miss Uncle Jack. Oh yes, of course Uncle Jack's shows are piped into the Garden District. But unlike the ones we used to get in the village, these seem to be recordings. The proof is that you keep broadcasting the same shows over and over. When I was a decent, proper citizen, Jack always had something new to say. Surely that can't just be joyful forgetting. Couldn't you play us whatever Jack's saying at the moment? Or if you must play us recordings, could you at least swap out the recordings from time to time? Abandon us if you must, but please don't take away our old friend Jack. Idiotic mask. Iliad petals. Cellar. <laughs> <laughs> 